today is a critical milestone for the XLA UV program. We're going to be naming the program today, which is super exciting, but we're also delivering a dive LD, which will act as a test bed uh, for the XL program, enabling us to go faster and to deliver on time for the Royal Australian Navy. We're living in a time of great strategic change, which is driving an urgency for Australia to get disruptive technologies into the hands of our warfighters. This means we've got to work differently. We've got to partner early with industry, share risk, and see how fast we can go in getting minimum viable product into the hands of those warfighters so they can figure out how they might be used to deter our enemies. Make no mistake, extra large autonomous undersea vessels will be a game changer. They will provide militaries with a persistent option for the delivery of underwater effects in high risk environments, complementing our existing crewed ships and submarines, as well as our future uncrewed surface vessels. Rear Admiral Quinn and Professor Tanya Munro, the Chief Defence Scientist, um, have been absolutely pivotal in accelerating Australia's innovation agenda. What they have brought is an ability to take risk and to, and to enable Andrew to do what it does best, which is to go fast. It gives me great pleasure today to name our sovereign XL AUV program the Ghost Shark. The reason that we need new and emerging technology is so that we can create strategic surprise, but also so that we can avoid strategic surprise. And these are both critically important to make sure that our men and women in the Australian Defence Force have the best capability that they can. The speed at which we're actually delivering, the concepts that we're using in terms of how we partner, the commercial relationships, how we do it from an engineering perspective, are very, very disruptive in your traditional approaches. And that's why we're able to achieve these better than expected results. When the nation asks, the Australian industry has got the wherewithal to answer and bring capability both to answer the national need, but also to create world-class capabilities for export. The Ghost Shark program is just one more example of those. Ghost Shark's name comes about from actually an indigenous shark that's found off our southern waters. And indeed, it's found in deeper waters, so it's quite stealthy, which is a good corollary to the stealthy extra-large autonomous vehicle. It also gives that lineage to the Ghost Bat, the MQ-28 program for Air Force, which is also another quite stealthy autonomous system. Risk and the appetite to take risk is at the core of these types of agile ventures. In our More Together strategy, Defence Science Technology Group set a goal to be able to move faster to take higher risk. Navy is a wonderful partner in that, and that meant that when Andrew Australia approached us with this idea, we were primed to go.